in light of the recent decisions of the Peruvian Congress after approving to debate the motion of vacancy against President Pedro Castillo, in an interview with Ramiro Angulo, correspondent from Lima, Peru, gives us more details. In effect, today, at about 12 noon, a vote was held on the decision of the vacancy to process the motion of censor against President Pedro Castillo, with 76 votes in favor, 41 against, and one abstention. Monday, March 28 was established as the day that the President of the Republic will have to attend. It should be noted that the meeting of Spokman was also held in which it was established that the President will have to attend tomorrow to the Congress of the Republic due to a request made by the Premier Aníbal Torres last Friday, asking that the President be invited to give a message to the nation. So for the time being, tomorrow will be the visit that the President Castillo will make to give the message about which there is not much information about it. There are many perspectives about what he's going to say, and on Monday 28 will be debate about the possible vacancy for which 87 votes will be needed for him to leave office if this is materialized. In the case of tomorrow, he is the one who will attend to give his message. Apparently, it will be about the government policies and actual plans. Wherever for the vacancy his legal defense could go, Castillo could go to give a general message on the matters that have been raised for him to respond, but he's also entitled to have his lawyer defend him at the legal level. That will be for March 28.